and Shirley Firth were first introduced to cross-country skiing in their hometown of Inuvik in 1965. Their strong competitive drive and love of skiing, combined with support from the Territorial Experimental Ski Training Program, soon landed them a spot on the Canadian national team. The commitment to their sport meant leaving their home in the Mackenzie Delta and moving to Banff. Together, the sisters became members of the first Canadian Junior National cross-country team to race in Scandinavia, and Sharon became the first Canadian to medal at a European event. With a lot of hard work and determination, and support from the Banff community, they were soon proving themselves as Canada's most accomplished Nordic ski racers. They competed in seven World Nordic Championships and 12 Canadian Senior Championships, where they won a combined 76 medals, 46 of them gold. The sisters made their Olympic debut in Sapporo in 1972. However, it was the 1976 Olympics in Innsbruck where Sharon and Shirley teamed up with Sue Holloway to earn a seventh place finish, still the best ever finish for a Canadian women's Olympic cross-country relay team. Together, the sisters competed in two more Olympic Games, becoming the only Canadian women skiers to compete in four consecutive Olympic Winter Games. In 1982, Shirley's best year on the 10-race World Cup circuit, she earned what was at that time the highest point standing by any male or female Canadian cross-country skier ever, finishing the season 11th overall. The Firth sisters have been honoured as recipients of the Queen's Golden Jubilee Medal, the Order of Canada, and an induction into the Canadian Skiing Hall of Fame. But perhaps their strongest legacy is the inspiration they left for upcoming cross-country skiers. They were tireless and dedicated to their sport, and they set the stage for the next generation of female racers.